ki khubor ka baate si TV. Lawan Rashapi da ka Frank Motors. Visit Frank Motors or call seven zero four five two zero seven nine seven three. MIT University of Meghalaya. Our admissions are now open for the academic year 2024-25. Explore our best courses. Experience global collaborations. Apply today. Ka Grace Institution Bangalore ka college puli nursing ka babhatam nagabanta ki kina ka migalia kala play ya ka admission minta. But as I said, wherever there have been cases like this, the police has been asked to immediately act and uh, file cases. And as I mentioned to you. Mandiri Ramba Kajalau Konrad K. Sangma Uret Ho Shagila Pathai Kubor Baki Pulai Kelapan Ngat South Lee Ki Mukot Duma Yaki Beri Ki Beli Khandra Laisen Niki Nong Bala Bajala Ki Bidang Pintra Yaki Projek Jangka Sorkar Haji N Stadium Hamaran Polo U Konrad Ulo Oma Ki Nogi Nogi Kin Hoon Ki Mla Bernit Khandra Laisen Barjala New Work Permit Haki Jaka Bapin Pintra Yaki Projek Jangka Sorkar Bat Day Tan Ki Beri Ka An Ki Bela Ban Lea Yakani Ulit ho bakum ka nga jing jaak la jaak hamin shwaru bat ki pulit ka rakyam no ya kita ki beri ka wiran ka tiba nait kumni. Ka nga jing karun umintri rang ba ka deha diin baka khasi students union ka lalit ban khandra laisen na ki bar jala ki betre bila ha ka leng ka nong ba shilong bakum juru hamaran polo. There is nothing called work permit. There is a registration that is done by the labor department and that is what is the only policy that is followed by our state. And this, as you know, was uh, uh, done by our government only in the first MDA one, and uh, is the labour department that uh, looks into all these aspects. So, uh, uh, as I said, there's no work permit or nothing like that, but registrations are mandatory, and this is done, and this was done, if you recall, uh, from all aspects. Number one, as I said, to provide safety for uh, the uh, the respected uh, individuals and labourers also. Uh, and also to keep a uh, uh, full database of the different laborers who are working in the state. Uh, number one, nobody is authorized to check these uh, papers. That's number one. And nobody can. Uh, of course, there are incidents where individuals go or organizations go and on, but that is not as per the law. So therefore, they are completely on the wrong side of the law when they go and check. And uh, just to inform that uh, the government and the the police has in fact <coughs> filed cases against uh, four cases have been filed FIRs have been filed against different organizations who have done this in the past few days number two uh, you've mentioned that uh, uh, that individuals have or organizations have mentioned that uh, government has failed to implement the ILP there is the question of implementing the ILP doesn't arise because ILP has not been uh, passed or not been implemented or not been uh, uh, enforced in the state of Meghalaya uh, we have passed a resolution in the state uh, assembly uh, that uh, urging the government of India to, to implement the ILP in the state, but that has not been cleared yet. So the question of imp not implementing it doesn't arise. That's number two. MRSSA is a fact, again, you are aware that we had passed the MRSSA, made the amendments in it, uh, but it was at the governor's level and governor had then uh, sent it uh, or, or mentioned that it should be uh, sent to the central government, uh, home ministry, but for president's assent and accordingly we had sent it they had sent back and asking us to uh, look into different aspects which again we are uh, examining those aspects and seeing how to move forward because a lot of uh, points that were mentioned by government then. so the question of non-implementation doesn't arise regarding the point that the contractors have to it is a must that's what the law says so there is no question of any contractor not registering any of the laborers coming in from outside. So the law passed by the Meghalaya Assembly says that they should. My point being that if there are any contractors who are not doing, let the organizations, individuals, public inform the state government and state government will then take the action. But individuals cannot take action, organizers cannot take action against this contract, is what I'm saying. But then it's only 191 laborers who are found without valid and proper documents. So what then? So if that is the case, let them give in writing, is what I'm saying. And let them complain to us. And there is a system and a process to be followed. But you cannot go and take the law in your hands, is what we're saying. That is incorrect. So under this prosecution, in case the libel? Uh, yeah, libel means what the prosecution is and what the uh, the penalty is. That I, Those details are not with me. But it is the responsibility of the contractor to register his or her labels. <coughs> the, the, we, we, will, we will take up, as I said, the matter at the contractor's level. But again, I'm reiterating 
that there's a process to do it you complain to the government to the department or the particular labor officer or to the minister concerned but you cannot go and take the law in your hand and check is what i'm saying so if you have a complaint you have an issue with thing you inform us necessary action will be taken against the respective uh, contractor because these things may happen i'm not saying it's not happening but as i said that's not doesn't mean that you go and take the law in your hand is what i'm saying so therefore procedure should be followed definitely government will react and uh, act on this definitely will take action against the concerned person but procedure of complaining to the government is what the proper way to do it is for me to sit here and say that they are uh, that 100% they are all adhering would uh, not be possible because there are many people working everywhere but as per the law uh, each one has to be and um, you know uh, most of the locations most of the individuals uh, and most of the contractors are adhering to the uh, to this particular law and whenever if there is any situation where somebody is not adhering people can complain and inform to us and we will take necessary action so that is my whole point that if there is a concern raise it with us and we will take up the matter and we'll talk to the specific individual or the particular contractor who is responsible for that no project is being stalled because of this kind of uh, uh, you know uh, checks whatever they call it i wouldn't call it checks they are just simply coming and intervening and trying to you know uh, disturb these projects which is not correct these projects whatever projects are going on are in the interest of the uh, of the state and the people uh, if anybody has any concerns and issues they should follow and they should ask the departments to you know find out and give a list and uh, of course if anybody has any concerns we are ready to inform and give them the information but as i said taking the law in their own hands and going and do the checking social checking or whatever they may call it uh, is something that is actually not at all acceptable and as i said uh, as per law uh, and the provisions of the law the police will take necessary action you see uh, there are incidents uh, last time also if you are aware that uh, arrests have been made in those cases so those are the news that sadly the uh, press doesn't carry uh, they carry the more sensational news uh, but when those uh, arrests were made then there were reactions uh, but we stuck to those arrests and the cases are still going on so we have been firm but uh, that was not carried again in the press uh, now also in fact as i said we have already filed uh, cases and uh, as for the provisions of the law the action will be taken i don't want to uh, say anything more right now the police is doing its job whenever the incident wherever happens the immediately the police goes to tell them that you cannot do this and please leave and cases are filed against them. Right? but as i said wherever there have been cases like this the police has been asked to immediately act and uh, file cases and as i mentioned to you uh, four cases have been filed